Thanks for tuning in to our bonus episode preview. This is just a short sample of this week's exclusive Patreon episode. You can hear the episode in its entirety by becoming a member at patreon.com slash indoctrination, where you'll gain access to all of our exclusive episodes and merchandise. Hi, everyone. Thank you so much to you, our patrons, the ones who really are helping to support the show and keep it on the air. Truly, truly, truly a work of love and support and very much appreciated. Today, I want to be able to talk about someone who has become a spiritual guru, a man named Jay Shetty, S-H-E-T-T-Y. So, I've come across many Jay Shettys in this world, people who mm, kind of feel that they have the answer. They are also able to package themselves in appealing ways, in ways where people believe them, They craft a story around themselves, kind of a mystical story, a mystique. They have a way of coming across like they are enlightened. They are self-actualized, whatever that means. And that they have the answer for you. So, let's get into who this Jay Shetty is. And also, before we do so, The reason that I talk about people like him is not to defame him. It's not to slander him. It's to let people know how unfortunately easy it is to come across like you're the expert and you know what people like in their life and what they need in their life and what they should be experiencing and feeling and the direction they should be going in. He has amassed so many followers, just as many others have. And what you want to be able to do when someone has amassed so many followers and has millions of people who seem to listen to their every word, you want to get a sense of who this person is and if they really have the answers, or at least some of them, or if they are just very polished snake oil salesman. So, after graduating college, Shetty said that he gave up a life of material success to live as a monk himself. Mm, It's hard to know when people tell these stories if they're true or not, but that's part of his story as he tells it. And then, three years later, He has another revelation that his purpose in life is not to live the humble life of a monk, but to use his preternatural oratory skills to share wisdom with the world. So, I think at this point, he either really thought that he had something to share with everyone or he was tired of the idea of living as a monk, and wanted to have a different kind of life. Either way, again, we're not sure the monk part of the story is even true, but again, either way, he made a big shift. And he then transformed into being a public self-help personality. And he had a very swift rise to fame and swift rise to fortune. Supposedly, his goal is to make wisdom go viral and help others find their life's purpose. So, let's talk about Jay Shetty a little bit more. 